start the 85 gotta let it warm up a little bit so we're letting it warm up today before i go to work just want to um talk about something and um what i'm talking about here is paypal have you heard the latest about paypal paypal came out with this statement like a couple days ago they want to charge people for misinformation whatever they deem was misinformation they want to be able to charge you twenty five hundred dollars they want to just fine you like uh put a hold on your bank account take twenty five hundred dollars because they thought you were promoting misinformation on the internet now we already know what that means you know whatever they feel like um goes against whatever they believe is true or, or not true or whatever and um so i've been a paypal uh, user for 16 years so i closed my account so the best thing to do is if you are a paypal user <clears throat> close your account close it let's kill their stock you know let's uh make companies like this take notice that you know they are not totalitarianism or authoritism or whatever you want to call it um, this is not a socialist type of thing where the government or whoever is in control of all this stuff is going to go out here oh my light is burned out is going to go out here and basically enforce their rules whether it's through a private party like uh, paypal or through direct through the government and make you do or say things or not say things and then try to find you and, and restrict by a monetary thing that that's ridiculous so this is just one step to take back control of your life i mean we give a lot of control up whether it's in our email our social media things like that but it's just ridiculous it's hard to believe this would be happening right now, but they want to find you for things that you say in social media. So, first thing you do is you cancel your PayPal and you start buying stuff directly for your credit card. And then we find out certain credit card companies were doing underhanded stuff too, but that's a time for another thing. So I just want to share that with you this morning. The latest thing on the news, you can Google it and search it, but there's plenty of things out there about this PayPal. They quietly, or at first they were trying to walk it back and now they've had a public statement saying that shouldn't have gone out. No. They got caught. That's what happened. So look it up for yourself. Do what you need to do. I personally closed my PayPal account. I'm not gonna support anybody that's gonna just randomly try to take money out of my damn account. Okay, talk to you later. Right, <laughs> just in case.